it's already happening, the change, that people are more aware, they are more involved and they want to participate. And also that they force the government to listen what people have to say. And they, it's, uh, you can't stay at home and expect that uh, somebody else is going to do what you need. You have to do something yourself. And, and uh, I think this is the, what the future has to be. And, and this is already happening today. This, uh, it starts here with this thousand people and then it will grow also in Sweden, in other countries as well. And, uh, and I mean, yeah, it has happened in many countries already, but right now is uh, the moment where some people haven't quite realized yet. And so the more, the more we come to the squares, the more we start to speak up, the, the more obvious it is that we want to participate. Because right now we can question, I guess the others, they didn't want to participate. Okay, but it's not their problem in a way, they're happy as it is. More people are out there and questioning and setting their agendas, the more clear it gets. What is the future we want to be in? Because it can, I can decide it. You can decide for me. We have to discuss it together. This is a process of uh, dialogue, what has to come of it. And also how to learn to listen. Because if I just tell and nobody listens, then it's also pointless. And also that if I just press what I want and it's not possible, then we have to find the solution together. And this is what has to be in the future, that, uh, that we all come to this together and start to discuss what can be possible for all of us together in this. Perhaps it's future without the borders, perhaps it's future without... The, I don't know what's the future. But we have to start to discuss it more and we have to start to do it together.